Development Update 5. Hello everyone. We are so excited to finally share the focus of our development efforts over the past few weeks. A large update focused on improving and extending planetary exocraft. A brand new exocraft is now available to drive across the galaxies. The rugged, fast-moving pilgrim. Look at that. Isn't that a beauty? <laughs> Dudes, that looks like an actual... That looks like physical. That doesn't look like it's graphics. That looks like a model. Oh boy. I hope that's a model like the... Uh, like the... Uh, the Explorer's Edition ship model. That'd be awesome. The Geo Bay for the Pilgrim is available for purchase from the Blueprint Analyzer. The existing Exocraft also have been tweaked. Multiplayer racing has been fixed. Inventory sizes have been increased and summoning has been made easier. Geo bays now only need to be built once. After that, all owned Exocraft can be summoned with the unlimited range on any planet uh, where you've constructed the new Exocraft summoning station. Ooh, that's lovely. New upgrades for the Pilgrim and all other Exocraft can be purchased from the Exocraft technician once their missions are complete. Exocraft handling can also be adjusted with a series of new technologies, allowing players to customize the grip or drift levels of their different vehicles. Your Exocraft fleet can also be customized with a full range of colors, decals, and boost flame effects available to choose from. <laughs> the full list of patch notes is available at the end of this post. Community research update. Specialist Pablo is dedicated this or sorry, is dedicating this week to analyzing the collected data before determining the next chapter of their research project. The galactic coordinates reported by their explorer friends require through investigation and the trace of another traveler entity beyond this reality suggests the recent galactic changes may have wider reaching impact than is yet understood. Community Spotlight. Oh, this is always cool. Look at that base! For the past few months, the Galactic Construction Company. Hey, the Galactic Construction Company! Uh, community have been quietly working on something really special, building in-game bases for other players in return for donations to UK-based charity Alzheimer's Research Society. Oh! They have now raised nearly 800 pounds for the organization and are still accepting requests for bases on their Facebook page. Oh, and I put a link there. That's awesome. Uh, we were really touched by this effort and have matched the amount matched the amount that they've already been donating. Oh, that's awesome! It's inspiring and unpredictable the ways games... Oh, that is amazing. Isn't that awesome? Right in the feels, Hello Games. And Boyd and his crew. Boyd Gaming. And the Galactic Construction Company. For a great cause. Oh my god, that's amazing. And then, the, and then Hello Games matched what they've, uh, what they've made. Oh, that's awesome. Congratulations, guys. That's amazing. Pirate Bay. By, by, there he is, Boyd Gaming. And the GCC. Oh, congratulations, guys. That is amazing. That's wonderful. That's such cool news. Oh, keep the fun and beautiful screenshots coming. Some that recently caught our eye. Look at that. Oh, these are great. Look at those rings, eh? Nothing but rings. Oh, that's a good one. Oh, with the shield. That's a cool screenshot because you got these little guys beside him too. Wow, that's a really cool screenshot. Rui's bros. Hey, Rui's got in there. That must be his up here. Oh, Rui. Rui's bros. Empire Pro 006. DJ Sims 10. And Suspiria 72. Oh, great screenshots. Hey, woo -woo. He's a nerd leaguer. We are uh, also delighted to see some creative placements of the customizable tree rewards from last week's community research mission. There's a whole forest there. Look at that. But it's a glitched matrix and Matador NMS. Oh, that's awesome. That's, that's so wonderful. Development update. Patch 1.63 is live on all platforms today with the patch notes available below. The next update will see the continuation of Pablo's research missions, as well as high priority quality of life improvements throughout the game. In the meantime, we are keeping up the pace here as we work towards another large update. Hopefully we'll be able to share some previews of that ahead of time. Thank you so much, Sean. No, thank you so much, Sean. 
Woo! <laughs>